Nicole Conklin here with my dog, Winnie the Wizard. And we are here at the first annual Tour de Corgi. It's amazing. Might as well be dog heaven. Let's check it out. Tour de Corgi was a huge success with a turnout of over 100 dogs and over 300 visitors. The Corgi Parade certainly caught the attention of Fort Collins locals as the dogs marched through Old Town and back to Library Park. You didn't have to be a corgi to attend the event. Dogs were dressed up as Vikings, cowboys, and more. It was a time where people could enjoy the pups and take photos with their favorites. Talk about a paparazzi. So I thought maybe half a dozen of my closest friends would show up and instead it went viral and 1,200 people signed up. <laughs> Tour de Corgi attracted all kinds of spectators to the park. Whether you had a dog or not, it was a day full of puppy love. Look at them, they're precious. I literally put my car in park. I'm like, wait, what? What? Tell me about this. She's like, yeah, there's like 300 to 400 corgis just running around town. And I'm like, I have to come back with Gabe. And I sped to his house and I sped back and here we are. Corgis, soft spot in my heart. It was hard not to be overwhelmed by the cuteness of all of the corgis. Winnie and I sure had a great time. If you too have a love for short and sassy dogs, be sure to check out the Tour de Corgi next year. Thank you.